Good morning, Groovy Life fam. Today, we are doing a Trader, Trader Joe's shopping haul. Brand new day, the sun is up. The birds and the bees are singing, shout, singing, oh. We took the kids with us, I'm on vacation, so we're gonna go get some groceries for the house and then when we get home, we'll share with you guys everything that we got from Trader Joe's, what we're gonna stock the house with. So we're gonna go in, we're gonna get our favorite things from Trader Joe's and then when we get home, we're gonna share with you guys everything that we got today and what we stock our house with and some of our favorite items from Trader Joe's. I got this. Sure, we can use that one. So what did we get today, Mama? All right, so we got some lemons, some bananas. Some bananas. This banana bread is amazing. Oh my I God, try to make banana stuff. bread like homemade and it doesn't really work out that well. This stuff is so <laughs> amazing. I love that banana bread. Okay, so the lady that worked there said these are the best chocolate chip cookies. And I guess they have like a lot more chocolate chips. I don't know, but it kind of reminds me of like a scone and a chocolate chip, and I may have eaten a little bit on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. So they're yeah. really good. Oh, and they also have banana chocolate chip muffins. Mm. Keith didn't see me get this, but those look amazing with coffee in the morning. I have to have that. One of our favorite things is this Trader Joe's meat lasagna, and it tastes homemade. Like, this is amazing. And Presley loves this, and she is not a big meat lover, so you know what? Tastes really good. It's honestly one of the best frozen meals, yeah. like Italian style meals that um, I've ever tasted. And I know Costco, I've heard Costco has some really good stuff too. Um, but yeah, we try not to eat a lot of frozen foods, but this is seriously like the best lasagna. I made homemade lasagna and like, you know how like the noodles like crinkle up, like, I don't know, like sometimes they get hard. I don't know, this is seriously amazing. It tastes the same every time and yeah. it tastes homemade, so. Totally agree. That's like one of our always, the things we always buy when we go to Trader Joe's for sure. Yes. Some <laughs> what broccoli. Else we got? Yep, gotta get the broccoli. These are really good. The vegetable guys, I don't know, but they're like pot stickers or like, um, what are those called? Dumplings or something. Yeah. And they're just pot vegetable stickers. and you use it with, um, or we eat it with soy sauce and like a side of rice, but no preservatives. I love that. We get that all the time yeah, too. That's really that's good. another thing that almost every time we go to Trader Joe's, we pick up at least one bag of that. They're potato French fries. Yeah. These are really good too. Gotta have some fries. And it's actually a huge bag, so it could be like one or two meals. This is new, I think. I don't know. I haven't seen this, but they finally came out with the individual packets of guacamole, which I like to add on our salads or. The girls even love it, and when we go to the beach or the park or something, we could take like a pack with like chips. So definitely, that's how it was kind of cool that they had like the individual packets. Yeah. The girls have been loving soy milk, so we or almond milk with their cereal in the morning. So we got two of these almond milks. I don't know what the other one is, but and I, I, I don't know if you guys watch Aspen and Parker, but she's like one of my favorite vloggers right now. I love her like energy and everything, but she made this soup, so I told Keith about it, and you put like zucchini and squash in it, and some other stuff, so we got zucchini and squash. It's like a spicy veggie soup. Yeah, and it's like a veggie soup, yeah. so maybe we'll show how to make it later or something. Yeah. So. Apples. Yep. 
And these are like mini ones, so I thought the girls can eat it themselves or we can cut it up. Yeah. And sometimes we like to do some juicing, so we'll yeah, juice like we fruit and veggies. So we got an extra bag yeah. just for juicing. juicing. Juicy. Oranges for juicing or the girls like to eat slices of oranges. And the, their sizes are like good. Yeah. There's like a lot of oranges. Let's see. Their bagels, I don't know why their bagels are so good and they're so fresh. And so we got one bag of these. Let's see. The girls' favorite cereal, Panda Puffs. And it's so much cheaper at Trader Joe's. So we got two boxes of those. Yes, so if you're, if you're a parent and you have kids and you haven't had the Panda Puffs or your kids haven't had the Panda Puffs, we definitely recommend it. The kids absolutely love it. It's a lot of a healthier alternative than a lot of the other cereals that are in the cereal aisle. So, and Trader Joe's, if you have one nearby, it is definitely a couple dollars. It's like $2 cheaper than any of the other stores at Trader Joe's, so that's, that's pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, it's like $2 cheaper a box than Publix, so we always grab like two boxes. Yeah. We got some orzo, which we've never, I've never cooked orzo, but she, um, Aspen used it in her soup, so we got some orzo. Okay, these are my favorite, and they're like the mixed nuts, and it has like individual packets. Yeah. So I always like throw some like in my purse or something for the girls or me. The girls love those. Yeah, and they love that. This is the best granola. Mm -hmm. I eat it sometimes for breakfast with some banana slices and almond milk. So, so good. Pumpkin flax granola. Totally agree. Usually you can only find it during the holiday season at Publix or something. So, Trader Joe's must have right here. Keith, you got these crackers. Yeah, that's something new. So I saw these crackers here. Leave in the comments below if you guys have had them before, but they looked really good and I saw a couple people eyeing them. So <laughs> I thought, you know, what the heck, we'll give it a try. See, that's what Trader Joe's does to you. There's all these really cool, like, different packaging and, and different type of products that I've never seen or I don't really see in other grocery stores. So this was one of them, something different, something I haven't tried before. Um, it could be something that's really popular at Trader Joe's. I'm not quite sure, but I'll let you know what we think later on. We got this really, this coffee is really good actually. And it's like less than $5. So we got some coffee. Some Joe coffee. Pasta sauce. Pasta sauce. A can of white beans for our soup that we're making later. What's this? Oh, this is really good. It's like the white shell macaroni and cheese, white cheddar. The girls love it. Vegetable broth. Okay, this ketchup. I do not like ketchup, but it is so good. Organic ketchup by Trader Joe's has like the best flavor. I don't know why. I remember like when I first yeah. bought it, I was like, this is the best ketchup ever, and I don't really like ketchup. So ketchup, green olives. I'm obsessed with green olives in my salad. Yeah. <laughs> so I had to get that large jar. This, this is is the girl's favorite popcorn. And it's really, really, really good. That's it's, a must. Like, like for us, too, for yeah. us, that's something that every time we go to Trader Joe's, we have to get at least one or two bags of that white this white cheddar popcorn. And then you got these new plantain chips that they came out with. Yep, that's Usually something get the other new. bag, but they these are like a different kind. So. Yeah, that's something new we're gonna try. And then the girls, they always pick out random things when we go there, but the baked, I don't know, what are these, Cheetos? Yeah, they're like the Cheeto Trader Joe brand. Italian bread, French baguette, you can't go wrong yeah. with that. Peyton picked out these chips, I don't know what, <laughs> Kettle cooked potato chips. Reduce guilt. Reduce guilt. Oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Daddy got some avocados. Avocado. So I like guacamole. Keith likes avocados. So got both. Yep. And they're really cheap there. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about these. So I saw these are mini blueberry scones, but they're like soft. So it's kind of like a muffin top, I guess. <laughs> like it reminds me of like the muffin top. Like it's yes. soft. All right, and oh, these Blackberry Sparkling Water. This is their new brand. I've never seen it. They said that they just got it in. So I love Blackberry. I'm excited to try these. We drink those LaCroix drinks too. It's like the sparkling water. So, all right, what else do we have here? 
Now we got some greens, green beans, and these ones are already cut, so I really like those. <laughs> the spring mix. You notice how we started with all of the snacky, unhealthy stuff that you know you can't help but buy a Trader Joe's, and now we're gonna share some of the healthier stuff that we got today too. <laughs> yeah, we do eat pretty healthy, but I feel like this time we got a lot of snacks. But you're on vacation, and Peyton's like out of school right now, so yeah. we did get grapes. We always trade back and forth between red and green. Yep. Some eggs. We got a fresh pineapple. Gotta have pineapple. We usually yeah. get a pineapple every single grocery trip, so. These large thing strawberries, which I guess they're not in season right now, so they're a little more expensive this time. We have some little helpers. Hey, Peyton. I got three bags of carrots. Three yeah, bags of carrots. We're gonna juice those, and actually the girls really like carrot apple yeah. juice, so. We're probably going to do some of those. I love And so for organic carrots at Trader Joe's, they're um, like 89 cents a bag. So that's Yeah, they're so crazy affordable. Cheap. Like, yeah. and I mean, they're also, small. They're definitely small bags. But I've been like skinning them and cutting. Instead of buying like the bat or like a bag of um, carrots, I've been like skinning these and cutting them into chunks, and then the girls will eat on them or we'll yeah. put them in like salads. So that's, that's so fresh it. Fresh strawberries, that's some eggs. I think that's it, right? Yeah. I love I love So guys, that is the shopping haul for today for Trader Joe's. Um, we didn't really go too crazy. I don't know. What do you think, babe? Was that a lot? No, I think like, well, with the large, like the girls have been eating so much lately. Yeah. They eat way more than me. And I'm like, I thought I was eating a lot because I'm like pregnant and I'm like, these kids can eat. And I don't know what it is about when I'm on vacation, but when I'm on vacation, uh, I like to have some really good like snacky foods because when I'm working, uh, I'm kind of in like a routine of eating kind of healthy and, and eating salads and stuff like that. So when I have time off and time with the family, uh, it's nice to have some some really unhealthy stuff too sometimes. Plus we've been going Mix to the up. park a lot lately and yeah. we're always in the car. So I always think of like, okay, what can I pack in my purse? Or like if I go to a doctor's appointment, the girls like are going crazy. So like these, they do sell like a big bag of the nuts, like a big bag. But I was like, I don't know. I'd rather just like spend the extra dollar and have it individually wrapped, you know? Yeah, definitely makes so, our life a little easier. Yeah, it makes it a little bit easier. So there it is, guys. Trader Joe's haul in the history books, all done. And that is the end of today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us, for watching our vlogs, we really appreciate it. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. We hope you subscribe and join us for some more adventures. Don't follow mind me, the, I'm already snacking. <laughs> follow the baby journey here. Baby number four will be here in July, so we're super excited about that. And if you haven't seen yesterday's vlog, uh, in yesterday's vlog we actually shared um, the birthing center where we're gonna be having the baby. So we did a little mini tour, showed what the room will look like, so you guys have a little glimpse into what that experience is gonna be like. But we love you guys, thank you so much, and we'll see you in our next vlog. Bye. Mommy.